Radar and satellite nice and clear. Currently, we did see some light shower activity move off towards our east earlier today. All that has moved off towards our south and east, and we should stay relatively dry for the duration of the weekend. It is going to be overcast most of the weekend, but nonetheless, not bad at all. Right now, currently partly cloudy skies, a current temperature of around 51 degrees with a dew point of 47 degrees. Light variable winds out of the north. Tonight, we are going to drop down to about 44 degrees, and we'll continue to see those partly cloudy skies with a nice breeze out of the east northeast at around five miles per hour. We're a few degrees warmer tonight than what we were this time last night. So about nine degrees warmer in Wiggins, seven over in Macomb, Hattiesburg and Laurel, about four to five degrees warmer than what we saw this time yesterday. As we move into the weekend, we're going to continue to see those mild conditions across Mississippi, portions of Alabama as well. The rain is likely going to stay off to our south and east. But as you can see, once we get here close to home, we do see some isolated shower activity. But all in all, we should stay mostly dry through our Saturday and Sunday. Mostly cloudy for tomorrow at the noon hour. Cloudy skies, 58 degrees, warming up to 65 by the 5 p.m. hour. Possibly some peaks of sunshine, but generally speaking, overcast and cloudy. So here's what you need to expect. More clouds than sun and we're going to see just a very, very slight chance of a shower tomorrow. Rather cloudy on Sunday and Monday is when we begin to see more clouds build into the region. Temperatures do warm up and so do the afternoon rain chances for our Monday and we're going to see our forecast lows tonight drop down to about 44 degrees in Hattiesburg, 43 in Sanford, Prentice, 44 degrees, 44 over in Columbia. So generally speaking, temperatures tonight with that cloud cover are going to be a few degrees warmer. That's cloud cover acting as a blanket to keep those temperatures up in the low to mid 40s. Warming up tomorrow to the upper 60s across most of the area we will struggle to get out of the 70s, but nonetheless, upper 60s is quite comfortable for this time of year. As always, our forecast is brought to us by Richard Swartz and Associates. We'll take a look at that seven day here. Just a very slight chance of a very isolated shower for our Saturday. High temperature of 67 degrees, mostly cloudy Saturday and Sunday. Now on Sunday, we are going to see a 68 degree high temperature. Much of the same again on Monday, except a decent chance of rain showers on Monday through about the middle of next week. Temperatures climbing into the upper 60s into the low 70s. By the end of next week, temperatures are unseasonably warm into the 80s. Once we get past those rain chances, Monday, Tuesday and Wednesday, that's when temperatures ramp up into the 80s, but they steadily fall right back down behind a cold front that passes through Thursday, dropping our temperatures back down to closer to where they should be in the 60s. Mm -hmm. Pretty good. Pretty warm. Bad joke. No more tissue. Please. You have no appreciation for fine arts. <laughs> what about the groundhog tomorrow? Tomorrow is Groundhog Day. Is he going to see a shadow? Well, he has consulted me, and I've given him some <laughs> sound sage you. advice on if he's going to see a shadow or not. We'll see. What do you What do you guys want? You want to see him a shadow? See it? No. No. Don't care. Don't care. No. Thank you, Scotty. Yeah.